Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. In today's video, I'll be doing a review on this Savaland acrylic set. It comes with 20 colors. I'll be using my Model 1's number 8 Kalinske brush today. And let's get into swatching. The original price is $32.99, but on Amazon currently, there's a 50% off coupon, making it only $16. Here's all the swatches. We have 7 glitters and then 13 just plain colors. I'm also going to be using Mia Secrets Clear and Cover Almond. And starting on our thumb, I'm going to do an ombre from the deep blue glitter into the purple glitter. I'm personally a fan of Savaland acrylics. I find that they're so easy to work with. They stay right where you put them. They don't set too fast either. They really give you plenty of time to mold them. And as a beginner, when it comes to acrylics, these are 100% beginner friendly. Now I'm taking Mia Secrets Cover Almond and I'm laying that on the pointer nail. And with a French tip cutter, I'm carefully cutting out our smile line. For our middle nail, I'm laying the blue color. For the ring finger, I'm using this light purple color. And for the pinky, I'm just going to be doing the same thing we did to the pointer, laying our cover almond and cutting out a smile line. And I'm going to start laying our clear cap. This just helps to add strength and also prevent us from accidentally filing into our color. For our two French nails, I'm going to file the smile line, trying to get it as sharp as I can. This step is crucial for this to turn out right. Taking our purple glitter acrylic, I'm going to start laying that as our French color and slowly working it up toward the smile line. And now I'm going to clear cap. And for the pinky nail, I'm just going to do the same exact thing but with our deep blue glitter color. Now I'm going to clear cap that one. And now on to filing and shaping. Here we are, all filed and shaped, and let's get into the nail art. Starting on the French nails, I'm going to define the smile line with some white gel polish. Once those are done, I'm going to start painting white lines coming from an angle. These are going to be our spider webs, and I start to add in all the little details. And I'm just going to be doing the same thing for our pinky nail. I'm using McCart's rhinestone gel and I'm going to put some small dabs of it and start placing our rhinestones. Now with a fine nail art brush, I'm going to start painting on spider legs. And once we're done with that, I'm just going to add some simple black drips onto the ring finger. I felt the French nails were missing a little something, so I added a black line just to help define our smile line a little better. 
And jumping back to our ring finger, I'm just going to start adding little white highlights. And for our thumb with some white gel, I'm going to start writing out the word boo. And I add a little bit of black for definition. And once that's done, we're finally through with all the nail art. So now I'm just going to top coat everything. It was pretty tedious going around the gems on our spider nail. <laughs> One last cure. And here's the final result. The set came out so cute and perfect for Halloween. I really enjoyed working with the acrylics as well. I love how simple and pretty it came out. Thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed. If you like this video, please like and subscribe and I'll see you next time. Bye!